Today, I wanted to walk through one of my favorite features in TypeScript 4.1, and that is pedantic index signature checks. <clears throat> and this is a feature I'm really, really looking forward to. And basically what this does is it uh, makes us check if an index signature is defined before we try and access it. <clears throat> so to jump straight into code to kind of highlight what that is. Um, so imagine we have an array here of users and this array only has one user in it. Now, if I try and access the first uh, item from that array and access the index, uh, the, well, let's actually grab the name. So if I try and grab the name from that, That's going to work, but if I try and grab like the 24th item from that array and grab the name, TypeScript is not going to show me an error, which is uh, really worrying because this is one of the um, one of the kind of bugs that gets through a lot in TypeScript with uh, the limitations of TypeScript's type system. So if I try and run this now, we're obviously going to get an error, cannot read property name of undefined. And this is really, really annoying and in my opinion, one of the biggest weaknesses of TypeScript at the moment. Um, but in 4.1, we are getting a fix for that, which is this uh, no unchecked index access flag that we can pass through. Um, so you can have a read through this in more detail on Microsoft Dev Blogs. Um, you can also have a look at the pull request on GitHub. It goes into a lot of detail and is really, really well written and well thought out. Um, but we can just highlight this very, very quickly. So we go into ITS config. You'll notice that I already had strict null checks as true, so that's not actually going to save us. What we need is we need this no unchecked index access flag, and we set that to true. And as soon as we jump back into our code here, we will see we get this TypeScript error. Object is possibly undefined. Um, so what that means is we have to do this null check, uh, undefined check first. So we can run this, we get undefined, the error goes away. Um, one thing to note though is even if we try and grab the first item on this array again, we're still going to get this same error. And that's because TypeScript has no way of knowing how many items are actually in that array. All this flag is doing is just saying anytime we try and access an array item by index, we're going to need to do a null check first. Um, so we still get that back. Um, I'll show you as well. TypeScript has really good type uh, narrowing. So we can do uh, we can do something like this. Const first is going to equal to users, and then we can say if first console.log first.main. So this is going to work. We're not going to get a type error here because we're already checking for the existence of this. So I can run this again. Cool, and we're going to get that name. But if you have a look at this, if I get rid of this if first, Again, we're going to get this type error here. Object is possibly undefined. And that's what TypeScript is really, really good at. It's good at just figuring out exactly what your type narrowing is at, at each step. So again, we can just, we can do this. Um, and yeah, that's basically the feature. So it's, uh, it's a feature I've been looking forward to uh, for a while now. I'm really, really excited about this. Um, as soon as it's released uh, in general, you can just turn on this flag, no unchecked index access in your TS config or pass it in through as a build parameter and you'll start getting that extra type safety.